yeah, so you try and touch it like, oh, get it. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. For today's video, I'm giving you a first impression on a unit that I got from wigtypes.com. But before we get into all the specs and what I think about the unit, straight out the pack, make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also, make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you like videos like this so you can see more in the future. Now let's go ahead and get into this first impression. Okay, so this unit comes from wigtypes.com. I purchased it with my own money. It is by Sensational. It is the Cloud9 Swiss Lace What Lace wig by the name of Solana. I know I am late to the game, but I have had her for a while and she's been sitting on my shelf. So I figure I'm gonna go ahead and show her off and see if I like her or not after all the commotion has died down. This is what her car looks like. I got her in the color Flamboyage Wine. Did want the burgundy wine color. I was kind of hoping this was like a mix of that, but it's not. It's more 1B into like the burgundy wine color. This unit does retail for $48.79, so it is on the high side of the medium price point for synthetic wigs. This is a 13 by 6 lace parting area, so 13 inches from ear to ear, as well as 6 inches deep here in the middle. It comes with the two combs in the front, one comb in the back, and the adjustable straps. This unit is heat safe between 350 and 400 degrees, so if you want to curl her, you can or straighten her, but it already comes in these big barrel curls that I feel are just gorgeous for a date night. I will tell you guys, this unit is not big head friendly. We have learned this about most of the what lace wigs um, for the past couple months. They are not big head friendly. They are a big head associate. So I was able to kind of glue it down perfectly on or not. I didn't glue it all the way down, but get it all the way down on this side. But on this one, it was kind of up. So that's why it's kind of a little crusty over there. Um, I had to cut some little sideburn action over there. The lace is just like all the other wigs in this line. It is Casper Ghost friendly. Okay. So I did go in initially with my face powder and then I remembered, oh, the face powder is going to be too light. So I went in with my contour shade from the black radiance medium to dark palette and I went in and put it on my hairline so you can see right here it blends down a little bit better I don't really see a white cast on the monitor but you guys might but again they're still working on it so hopefully we get some units soon without the white cast but that is how it looks right now with just that contour powder on it now this unit does come with baby hair so if you do want to put them down you can I did not put any baby hairs down because I wanted to try to not do baby baby hairs because I've been doing baby hairs a lot and they don't always come out the greatest. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, we don't want to have them issues. So I think I'm gonna take a break from baby hairs and just kind of have her just situated back how she's meant to be. And I think it looks gorgeous. The hairline is not plucked. I left it how it is, how it comes, um, because this is a pre-plucked hairline. Like you guys know, all their units for the what lace line are pre-plucked. So I did not have to go in and pluck this. You can go in and pluck it some more if you choose to. I didn't feel like doing all that. I kind of want to just put it down and see what it was like. But that's how it looks on this side. And then obviously this side is out so you can see that now the hair texture of this unit um i wouldn't really say it's a yakky no it's 100 percent premium fiber so this unit will tangle it will shed eventually because of the length and the curls in it if you are someone like me who likes to put her hands in her hair please keep let, let me tell myself now please keep your hand out of this unit because it will make it tangle a lot faster i've already had some tangling out the pack which kind of sucks um but i've realized me touching it more and more or trying to get the curls the way I want it has made it tangle even faster and more. So keep your hands out of it. Like do something with them. I don't know what to do with my hands, but I got to keep them out of my hair. I can't, <laughs> there I go again. Cause <laughs> y'all see me try to touch it like, oh, get it. <laughs> 
I promise I'm not a crackhead, y'all. I promise. However, that is like the only con I have for this unit. Obviously, I wish it was more big head friendly so I could like, you know, lay this down how I want to. But I feel like how I laid it fits perfectly. It looks good. It doesn't look horrible besides this little crusty situation over there. Once I did my makeup and got it all situated, I feel like it looks a lot better. I would tell you, depending on the color you get, your curls may look a little fuller or flatter um, because of the natural color situation. So when you get a natural color, so like one to four maybe the hair isn't as processed but if you get a colorful unit so like what i have the density may be a little off in the unit so i did go in with my got to be free spray to kind of spray it down a little bit to kind of give them a little oomph you know a little pack of punch there to kind of you know liven them up a little bit and that did help just be aware of that if you get a certain color that the color the curls may not look the same as say someone else's unit that you see on youtube okay you may have to do some work like they did or whatever i'm glad that i kind of let the hype die down and then tried it for myself to kind of give my own opinion. I do not like that it tangles. I don't like that it sheds. I do wish it was more big head friendly. Um, but other than that, I think it is a pretty unit. Let's see if my husband putting the kids to bed because mama want to play. <laughs> If you guys have this unit, let me know what you think about it down below. There I go, you my damn hands in my hair. Oof. I will link the information for this unit down below if you guys decide to check her out. Um, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, and share this video as well. Make sure you smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.